Well, hello, GB here. We're going on a live shoot. And this is uh, my recon before attempting to take uh, a night shot of the Ellenville Buttermilk Falls. And I'm just uh, crossing the road of 52, getting out of the way of this truck. So there are the falls back there. So what I'm gonna do now is take advantage of the daylight to go and uh, recon, see how difficult it's gonna to be to get uh, down into there. to set up for a night shot right now. It's still very, very overcast, so it's not gonna be good tonight. But uh, tomorrow's supposed to be clear, so uh, maybe I'll pop back. It isn't all completely sucked in, which is good, so I'll get some uh, motion of the water coming down. But uh, what we'll do is I'll just head off and I'll see how we can get down there. Okay, well, there's the road. We'll just make our way across this little brook and head on back up. Whee. of snow falling off the trees because there's quite a breeze. <laughs> so I'm just going to make my way to this. Oh, snow's coming down really fast off these trees. Oh, I shall have to turn away. Okay, just going to make to the towards this big concrete abutment, which is part of a big dam when these used to be a big waterworks, but beautiful crystal clear waters. Not easy with one walking pole <laughs> trying to carry this GoPro. I should have brought the old chest harness out. Right, so the deal is it's going to be to get in down here. And there's a very narrow little few steps right here in the corner. So that's where I think I'll probably head for. And plant in right on those rocks because it looks shallow enough to stand in still. Yeah, so I think what I'm going to do is there's just rocks right down in there. I've already set up there, or maybe a little bit closer into the edge. This looks like really solid ice, so should be able to support my weight. Should give me a, a big clear shot up to the falls. It's either that or I'll have to put my chest waders on, which I think I will do actually. Beautiful icicle formations up there. 